mind over matter. Simple sign. Welcome, I'm Hawaiian Shirt Papa. Sometimes with others, I visit a variety of antique, vintage, and thrift shops within Southern Ontario. Sometimes we don't get anything. Come tour with me vicariously. Hello, and welcome to another tour by Hawaiian Shirt Papa. This time it's of the YSM Double Take. So you know, Young Street Mission thrift store. This is in Toronto, in what would be referred to as Cabbage Town. As associated with the mission, there's also a not attached but not accessed from the thrift store, the Computer Literacy Center. Here we are, we're entering it. It's a fair sized store, nice high ceilings. Uh, it makes it quite comfortable. It's uh, nicely displayed overall. They have windows which have these. Well, they've chosen specific items for there, I guess, for the looks. Give folks an idea what's inside. So they've got clothing, they've got hard goods, uh, books, small appliances. see the books and clothing the clothing accessories some of the stuff is on top of the shelves other things are on end caps interesting drawing set I don't think it was uh, professional but it's a good looking set I'm not sure if absolutely all the pencils were all there, but like I said, it still looks good. I'll leave that one for someone else to enjoy. Picture frames, microwaves, lights, things like that were over there. A couple of racks of shoes. And we were looking for the men's Hawaiian shirts. These. No, no, those weren't. This should be the general area they're in. And then I'm looking along. I've got a few things on the floor as well that I didn't quite expect considering how it's laid out. Going through the shirts. Looking to see if there's any prospects, even. Hmm. Not quite. The closer to business attire in Hawaii. And just in case I miss something. I went back. I'm looking along. Shorts. And there they are. They're on the wall. There are quite a few here. The red one you see on the end is one I did pick up. It's a little more pricey than I usually would pay, but it was uh, a Canadian. I don't know if it was made in Canada right now, but it was definitely a Canadian design. So I felt I had to get that. Probably use it somewhere around the Canada Day, maybe Halloween. And they had quite a good selection in a variety of sizes. So if you're in the area, you can pick up some. Some were just t-shirts. Other, most of them are shirts. As I said, quite a good selection. Maybe not all truly Hawaiian, but they uh, 
they evoke the the concept of Hawaiian style shirt. Moving along, we see some of the bins, and they have books. It's at the exit. Looking at some of the hard goods here, finally. Ceramics, uh, teapots, so on and so forth, sets of plates. So yeah, you, you can do quite well. May not be the cheapest thrift store, but you are supporting a good, uh, a very good uh, charity. I don't think, uh, oh yes, I did ask uh, Westwood Avenue if she did not want any of these glass pieces. Well, they weren't of uh, design that she was in the process of acquiring. It's nice to see some French signage available to folks. And here's the sign. Some things were very, very reasonably priced. This one did stay, I didn't bring it. They also have some jewelry, probably costume. I, I didn't take a closer look. And there's the sign that's at the entry exit. It's a welcome sign. Well, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. I wouldn't mind if you give us a subscribe, a like, and uh, maybe even take a put on a, a mark on the bell so you get notified. Thanks a lot, folks. Bye-bye.